you want a list of all the cool stuff we saw at IFA today? Because that's what you're getting. I'm joined by Edgar Alvarez. Is this the cool thing that you saw at IFA today? Yes. What is it? This is the Battle Worn BB-8. So uh, it's a newer or special edition uh, from the old one that we saw last year. Yeah. And this new one obviously has, you know, it looks a little bit dirty. It's meant to kind of resemble the character from the movie because it rolls around and gets dirty. So yeah. obviously it has to look like it's been in battle and trying to help everybody out, right? So yeah. uh, this little thing right here is going to be sold as a bundle with this thing, other uh, wearable right here. And this is the... Uh, Force band from also from Sierra, obviously, and what you can do is use your hands to kind of control and move BB-8 around. Uh, this thing will sell alone for eighty dollars, and this right here will be one ninety nine altogether. What about you? What did you see? So I am a big fan of smart watches that don't have a lot uh, of kind of too fancy schmancy technology, and Withings, who make uh, very subtle uh, smart watches have released a thing called the Steel HR. It looks just like a Swiss watch and it's got activity tracking inside, but this year uh, it's also got an optical heart rate sensor on the underside and a digital sub-dial that will just show you if you get notifications, you know, like a text message, little symbol will pop up. How much is it? It's gonna retail, the smaller version is gonna retail for $180, the bigger version, slightly more than that. Now I am joined by Nicole Lee. Nicole, what was the cool thing that you found on the show floor today? Um, I took a look at the Acer Chromebook R13. So the interesting thing about this particular Chromebook is that it's a hybrid, it's a two-in-one hybrid. So it's a laptop, you can sort of flip it around and it becomes a tablet. It's coming out in October, and in October is also when Google will finally start introducing Android apps onto Chrome OS. So all of a sudden you have way more apps on Chromebook. That's pretty cool. And um, has it got a touch screen? Yes, it does. So it's a laptop and a tablet. Flips around into a tablet and you can use it in a tent mode if you want to. So yeah. Okay. Here's the important question though. How much is it going to cost? $400 at least. That's not too bad. Yeah. Would you buy one? I think I would. It's pretty cheap. Yeah. Fair enough. That was our wrap up from day one of IFA for plenty more exciting stuff. Keep your eyes peeled on Engadget.com.